Hello you fellow musicians and gamers out there, this is Quina Gamer here and I am back with another episode of Let's Play Crash of the Titans. Yes, it has been a long time since I have played this game, as a matter of fact I think it's been 7 months since the last time I recorded this game. Wow, oh, talk about a long delay. But anyway, without further ado, let's get started with episode 4 which is called Temple of Zoom. And I'll talk more about that when we get to the actual level itself. Here we are. Episode four. Temple of Zoom. Oh, and I've forgotten yet, yeah, I have to use the analog sticks. So you see, it's been that long since I played Crash of the Titans, I think I may have forgotten what the controls are already. And that's not a good sign at all. <laughs> so here's hoping I don't die several times. But so far, so good. But to talk about this level, obviously the level title is parodying a, an Indiana Jones film. It's uh, Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. And what have we got here? Now I'm trying to remember exactly what happened in this bit, but I can't exactly remember what happened here. Okay, there's a staircase leading up to there. Oh wait a minute, I think I know what I need to do here. I think I need to take these different staircases uh, because it'll take me through different paths. So we'll just do this. Now a new mechanic is introduced in this, and I'm not sure if it's introduced in this first little bit here. We'll find out. No, I don't think it's this bit that is first introduced. Wonder what happens here again actually. Oh we've got some minions that we've got to fight, okay right. We've got this little control panel down there. Alright, let's go. Yeah, you probably hear me just mashing the X button just to Make sure Crash stays in the air for such a long time. Okay, right, yeah, now I need to remember I can't spin for an infinite amount of time. Not yet, anyway, until I get the upgrades that I, that I need for that. Ah, Combo King. Nice work. And I fall off. I get a reward and it's like, haha, you fall off. Ah, oh, that was a bit foolish of me to do that. I only lost a little bit of health, at least you don't... Oh my god. Ugh, stop missing the rope. <laughs> this is not going well at all. I need to jump onto that rope. Alright, thank you. Right, third time's a charm. Can't believe that I did that. <laughs> now, I forgot what does this do? Okay, it activates. Uh... Okay, now I need to jack that Titan there to. Okay, I don't need that rope to get back across there. Yeah, there we go. Right, now I need to jack this Titan here. Okay, I can easily just attack over spinning it. Okay, fine. Fine then, right, okay. Now, I'm gonna get rid of these minions first. Spike time. Oh, nice one. I think I took all of them out. Or did I, maybe I left one behind, I'm not sure. Oh no, I think I took all of them out. Okay. Alright, might as well just keep going from Titan to Titan. It is called Crash of the Titans after all, so I want to live up to the game's name. Okay, just keep using the spike attack, that's all I can really do on, on these Titans, just, just keep keep mashing the, the spike attack. Alright, time to break the wall down, and though we're not Chris Jericho, we're not going to break the walls down like that. Alright, I think I'm going to just get this other switch activated. Oh, now we got, oh, now I've got to jack that Titan right. So if this guy is still okay, he's he's dead now. Okay, right, I've got to jack this Titan myself then without any help. Okay, I was about to do the spin attack, but it wasn't necessary. Okay. Okay, now I don't remember exactly how this control again. All right, yeah, I can press the R1 button to target that. I believe it. Hey, David Seventeen, commented uh, down below on that saying that I could use the R1 button to target the. What I needed to, to get. Now, you know, forget it. I'm not uh, going on here, I'm just gonna take you out. Sticking with my Titan. Unless if I get badly damaged, then by all means, then I will jump onto the next Titan. But for now, I think I'm good. So, thank you, but no thank you. You can go. Alright, okay, let's see. Take that target out. There we go. And get the other one. My god, even the minions couldn't stop me from targeting that. That's pretty pathetic, if you ask me. I know that they're small, but seriously, I, I was expecting that like, you know, one hit from them would, uh, would, stop, would stop my momentum there. Okay, do you know what? I'm going to wait for you to just uh, faint and I'll, I'll collect the rest of your mojo. 
Whenever you're ready, faint please, thank you. Right, I'm just going to collect the rest of the mojo. Right, now I'm just going to jump without falling this time. Thank you, there we go. Now I can go up the tongue here. And into this. Mojo's mouth. See, I like the music for this stage as well. Oh, what's this one? Is that like a 50? That one? Crash, read the stone to discover the air grind. Ah, no, this is a new, the new mechanic I was talking about. So, the Aku air grind and jump... Uh, and press R1 to press block to slide. So here we go. Now this is a brand new mechanic, this one. And I believe I can press, well I can jump, but then press uh, R1 to go faster on the, the air grind. So hopefully I can get all the crates here and get all the mojo I can possibly get. And also, despite the remasters coming out as well, I mean, this is also Crash of the Titans' 10 year anniversary, so what better way to come back and play uh, Crash of the Titans again on the 10th year anniversary? And hopefully I get the game finished before 2017 ends. <laughs> Alright then, so... But the air grinding uh, mechanic is pretty cool if you ask me, but it's a pity that uh, one of my favourite uh, themes in this game doesn't play in this stage yet. I believe it happens in a later stage. It might be the next one, or it might be on the next... Uh, uh, island, I'm not entirely sure of the next uh, section of the game. Oh, now I can use the air grinding to actually take out the enemies, that's pretty uh, clever. Yeah, you see, I'm trying to reminisce, uh, trying to familiarise myself with uh, how the game went again. Okay, now I've got the one hit wonder for taking out the Titans. Oh, I don't want to waste it. Alright, just use the Aku grind here, just use the, the skateboarding, uh, Aku's a skateboard here. See, I quite like that, I like how you use Aku, Aku as a skateboard. They not only use them as a shield, they use them as other things, like a skateboard. I mean, that's that's pretty clever. Like, even though not a lot of people like Crash of the Titans Mind Over, Mind Over Mutant, which is fair enough, I mean, everybody has a different opinion, but, in my opinion, I mean, I do have quite a lot of liking for Crash of the Titans. I don't know about Mind Over Mutant yet because I still have yet to play that. Believe it or not, I actually have not tried to play Mind Over Mutant yet. I have heard like people have differing opinions about uh, oh yeah, Mind Over Mutant is better than Crash of the Titans because uh, some of the uh, the upgrades were better. But uh, and I think uh, Hey David Seventeen had also said that he thinks that Crash of the Titans is better than Mind Over Mutant because it doesn't involve all the backtracking. Which, I will say this much, uh, I don't think, I mean, this game has quite a lot of back backtracking though, and it's good that I got a lot of, uh, some lump through there to, help, to get some... Oh, no, 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 do not fall again. Okay, good. I was about to say, please do not fall again, clarinet. You do not want to do that. Yeah, I, I talk to myself sometimes, I really do. Just to keep myself right. I'm pretty sure everybody does. Like, you know, talks to themselves to keep themselves right for your life, like, you know, and the bit of things that they do. Alright. Oh, can I make that? Oh, I just barely made that one. I don't think that was meant to happen, but hey, I did it regardless. Alright, next staircase has risen. Oh, I got some concept art. Very nice. I still think that was kind of funny, though, that I got the Combo King Award and then I accidentally, then I accidentally ended up falling off of the, the stage. That, that, was a, that was a pretty big fail, but I'm still going to keep that in there, because that was pretty hilarious. Okay, what have we got next? Oh, I think, are we outside? I don't remember. I don't remember this. Okay, so I'm assuming. Oh, I think I remember this, but this is where Cortex is. I think. Yeah, this is where Cortex is because that's his airship. All right, what's this tip? Use small enemies to jack away the food chain. Use spike to jack. Oh, okay, right. Yeah, so this is just about like more jacking tips and everything like that. Okay, that's very good. I will definitely keep that in mind. And let's jump across. There we go. Have I got? Yeah, it's a cutscene race. I'll just be quiet for this one. Crash, you gullible fool! You walked right into my trap. Now I'll have you and the mojo. Cortex, why do you keep doing stuff like this? Well, actually, it's pretty fun. You should try it. You know, riding around in huge rumbling machines and whatnot. Very stimulating. Okay. Uka Uka taught me a new process called Mojo Mutations. I will use the stolen Mojo to create a huge army of loyal mutants. Not rejects like you guys. You jerk. 
But best of all, I will use this army to construct a mighty robot, the largest doomsday device I've ever built. I will smash Wumpa Island, then take over the world. And I shall call this robot the Doominator. Yeah, yeah. That name sucks. Cortex. Deal with Crash and my pathetic brother. I will take the mojo and Bandicoot female back to our base. I don't know why I like the look of Cortex's face, it's like he's staring right at the player, it's like, Ha, uh, you ready to get screwed over? It's like, you're not screwing me over, Cortex. How about I screw you over instead? Oh god, right. It looks like I may very well be about to be screwed over. Right, if I can stop doing that, I want to do this. Oh my god. Crash, I want to do the spin attack. Alright, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. But I just like the look on Cortex's face, and then uh, when Coco says, what? Well, that name is stupid. What, well, Coco? Do you think you could think of a better name for that? Are you trying to suggest that you want to take over the world like Cortex is? Where are you going with this, Coco? That's all I can say. <laughs> oh god, right, okay. Oh, gee willikers, that was no good, right. I probably should have taken out that guy first. Never mind. Oh wait, oh, here's one guy that wanted- Oh wait. Aha, right, okay, I know it's against me right now, but can I possibly- Oh no, don't you block, don't you block me. Yes. Right, now I want to take this guy out because... Oh no, no, no. No, Cortex, you're not liking anyone. You're not going to like anyone by the end of this. Right. Oh crap, no. Don't... Don't you charge your laser and get me after this. Oh, damn. Okay, right. Fine. I'll give you that. Oh, gee willikers. Okay, this is no good. Right, I'm running one health. Oh, no, no, this is no good. I may actually end up suffering my first death here. Which is totally fine, because, uh, you know, I will admit I'm not that good at this game. I probably need, like, you know, more practice at this, but at least I can admit that, so. Oh, no, come on. I don't remember it being this bad at this. Seriously. Oh, damn, that's not what I wanted. No. And I'm dead. Okay, Nukuka laughs at me. Okay, fine, Nukuka, you have the last laugh for the moment. Right, now, can I at least take this guy out first? Alright, there we go, that should probably lower his defenses right now. Oh, no, no. No, don't you dare. Aha! That's what I want. Now, I can use this one to take you out. Now, I can do this. Oh, come on, don't. Oh, really? You had to defend yourself there? Oh, wait, no, he's frozen. Oh, I've forgotten what that times ability is. I was thinking to myself, what? Oh, how can you defend yourself from an attack like that? It's impossible. Right, come on, recharge. Recharge your attack, yes. Right, you use it. And freeze him. Right, and now I can officially get him down. Yes. Now, that's what I'm talking about. Now I can finally use this guy to my advantage. Now, I can just use the laser here. I'm charging my laser! There we go. That's what I want. I know, very cliched reference, but I might as well have used it. Oh no, 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 you don't. Seriously, no, don't you dare take me out. Oh, come on. Right. Right, charge my laser, this is what you get as a punishment. Alright, might as well take you get you guys out, and I'm going to take, just, just whip them all with my tentacle and just take them all out. <laughs> Alright, is that done? Or do I need to hit Cortex now? I think I need to take down that platform, the Cortex is on if I remember correctly. Alright, smash the platform, yes. Now it's time to meet your doom, Cortex. No, I think I'm more I've got you, Cortex. I've got you in where I want you. And 
I think that's, that's it, isn't it? Because that's all I needed to do, is just, like, you know, whack down the... Oh, wait, no. This is what I need to do. I need to whack down all the platforms the Cortex is on. Alright. If I can actually hit the platforms, that'd be great. Mm. Aha, there we go. Now, just take the rest of these guys out. Oh, nice slow down there. I'm not cheating. I am playing by the rules, Cortex. I'm simply playing by what the game is telling me to do. Well, to be fair, I kind of am cheating because I'm using Nakuaku, but... If I wasn't using Nakuaku, it would have been incredible, but... Yeah. Okay, Cortex, I'll give you that. Yeah, I did cheat. Might as well be honest. <laughs> Alright. Let's get more mojo. If I can get an upgrade right now, actually, that'd be pretty good. Will I be able to get an upgrade? I do it. Considering the amount of time I've got left on the multiplier right now. Oh god, right, okay, I think I'm wasting a lot of time here. Alright, let's charge up the laser again. Alright, that's what I want right now. Okay, and just take you out. Come on. Alright, now I think it's over. Because there was three platforms I needed to take out. Oh, right, that's a done. I'll be quiet now for this next cutscene. <laughs> you think you've won, you furry simpleton? Well, Uka Uka got away with the mojo and your sister. You'll never find them in time. The next time you see me crash, I'll be controlling a world conquering robot. <laughs> Oh, I'd love to laugh. Come on, Crash. We're gonna get Coco back. Crash, we must stop them. We have to follow Cortex and find out where they've taken Coco. Oh, him, yeah. I'll leave him here, I guess. He seems okay. <laughs> was ridiculous and appalling. You failed to destroy Crash Bandicoot. I don't see what the big deal is. We got away with the mojo and Crash's sister. I got away with the mojo, and the big deal is that Crash Bandicoot is still alive. Cortex, I'm going to replace you. <laughs> Thank you, Master. <laughs> you can't replace me. My name's on the stationery. <laughs> That's right, top guy. <laughs> Unless you want to buy on the stationery, you'll respect the master. It's really nice stationery, too. Oh, I know. Glossy. Cortex, you have never been more wrong. Uh, thank you. Uh, what? What do you mean? <laughs> Thank you again! <laughs> Hotter than the first! <laughs> Allow me to announce your replacement, Nina Cortex! Oh, come on! He didn't even have a cop! Take out the trash, girls. Sorry, Uncle, but it's time for some young blood to lead us to victory. And now that we have Coco, we can make her build the robot. You won't get away with this! Crash will come for me and kick your butt! Oh, I hope Crash tries. I really do. After all, I need a new fur coat. <laughs> get to work on the Doominator! Make more mutant soldiers! I want Wumpa Island smashed flat! Your hair is dumb! Oh, shut her up. Well, episode 4 is now finished, and uh, that was a pretty interesting cutscene there. Oh, I missed one spike, but I was one away from getting a perfect rank in there. Never mind. Okay, no upgrades this time. What did I get? Okay, that's very cool. Yoctopus. Alright, that's what the name of that time was called, right? Okay. 
Or say if it's been successful. Right, okay guys, I think I'm going to end this part off. Like, what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a part per episode. So, episode 4 is now complete. The Temple of Zoom, or doom or failure whatever you want to call it from your perspective in my opinion it was kind of a temple of failure because i did fall down the hole like twice stupidly and then i ended up dying on the cortex boss fight so yeah a bit of a failure on my part but hey i'm not gonna be the best at crash the titans i'm only just playing this for fun and i hope you guys are enjoying this as well so uh, with regards to me finishing this Let's Play before the Insane Trilogy, it's going to be very difficult considering I've got a lot more episodes to cover in the future before the Insane Trilogy comes out. So I might as well announce this, there may be another delay of the game when the Insane Trilogy comes out, so I do apologise for that guys, but I'll do what I can with the Insane Trilogy uh, in terms of episodes. So. Until then guys, the next time I come back I shall be playing episode 5 of Crash of the Titans. So until then everybody, uh, if you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more Crash of the Titans videos, please feel free to like if you enjoyed this video, comment down below for your thoughts on the episode as a whole, or even just the, you know just general thoughts on the game or anything like that. And please feel free to subscribe as well for more upcoming content uh, for Crash of the Titans and you know the Ancient Trilogy coming up as well. So until then everybody, have a good rest of the day wherever you are, and I shall speak to you later. Till then, goodbye.